welcome back to Taco Bola Gaming. My name is Taco Bola. Let's finish our one Empire run playing as the Imperial Federation. Now, right now we have no one uh, who is not our subject in our faction, I believe. And you can see where everything is. So pretty solid there. Um, Paraguay took forever to uh, justify against, so... Uh, they're still alive, but it's just Brazil and Paraguay to go, I believe. And Paraguay will be done on the 19th of February, Brazil on the 14th of February. So it is currently January 1st, 1951. Minor, minor issues, minor technicalities. Um, let's see. Let's see. Maybe up here. Yeah, up there. You guys here. How much of you guys there? This should work. I've been having a lot of uh, kind of almost novelty uh, research going on and uh, Just kind of playing it out, um, but we're set up to go here. We have dropped a few more of the big bombs, but uh, we have 92 <laughs> right now. I've eventually just given up on construction. I am not, I'm not using all of that, but I, you know, South America is the most industrialized place on the earth at the moment, or infrastructure-wise, and then we are just building a ton of these bases just to try and keep our supply up as much as we can. We still have some things in low supply. I think it's only this one uh, naval invasion in the east, so hopefully it's not gonna, gonna be too bad on that front. Um, Russia is still giving us a ton of things. I can annex Russia if I really wanted to, but we're not going to. I always love this comes up that we need a bunch of uh, infantry equipment and then nope. But we're just going to uh, wait this out, get to February. I think by the end of March, for sure, we will have uh, finished this, and hopefully we will see that we have beaten the game. Well, beaten the game, gotten the achievement. But uh, we shall see, I guess. Yeah, like 2 million infantry equipment. We have 2 million infantry equipment. Not really sure what is going on with that one. Our occupations... We're doing really well on all of that front, so uh, not a big deal. I did have to um, annex China in order to free Tibet, and then I had to take Tibet. I did not get China's subject when I annexed them. Um, don't know if it would have counted to have a subject of a subject, but I know for sure that uh, it'll count if I don't have anyone over there, so um, that's kind of what we did. You have that if you're going. But it looks like Brazil will be first and then Paraguay. So uh, I know this will be a short episode. Hopefully, it's not a completely short episode, but um, this was fun. Um, it wasn't necessarily fun at the end, dragging this, this out. Um, but I think up until the, the Japan War ended, uh, through the Japan War, I should say, it was a fun, fun run to play. And then just kind of going for the achievement uh, here at the end. But uh, yeah, I'm, I'm very happy that uh, I have played King's Party at uh, Great Britain. I'm, I'm kind of excited to try and play some of the other ones, maybe a communist. Um, Great Britain or something like that, but to have finally played this this run is uh, very very nice and and um, it was a lot of excitement there at the very beginning, fighting, you know, just struggling to get the enough people out into the field to uh, defeat the Commonwealth of Nations, uh, getting all of that going, forming the Federation, um, all the stuff that I needed the guide for was a lot of fun and then 
uh, figuring out the wars and, and you know as much as I, I got frustrated with China um, declaring on me when I wasn't ready and having to pull all my troops constantly from the Soviet front that I was ready to fight uh, it was just constant having to pull those troops over uh, and then Japan doing the same thing to me uh, shortly after that I really actually kind of liked that and the fact that it wasn't um, easy on that front and I had to ramp up my production and get the largest army I've ever had in this game by far um, and you know just, just to have all of that stuff I, I think it was really really um, fun to me so I hope you all had fun watching Oh, that's me. Okay. But yeah, I, I hope you all had fun watching this, and uh, we're going to get started. Ready. They don't think that they can win. Well, you can win, trust me. If you don't win immediately... Signed to this line. Goodness gracious. Uh, well, we have uh, some yellow here. Might as well put them somewhere. Tell you to go here. Since you're there, come over here to get this one going. Get that started as well. Now I am also going to come over here and Orders. tell you to start, and then Orders. we're going to go ahead and tell you to start, even though we're not at war with Paraguay quite yet. And we should have uh, air going here. Um, why don't you have anything? Okay. Gotcha. Uh, looks like he needn't to have been worried. Looks like you did not need to worry. Why do I have one troop on here? Yes, sir. No, 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 no. Call it! Call 24, you come on, people. I guess I didn't check that. How about these ones? Are these 24 divisions? Yes. Okay. You have 15. Listen up. No, 24. Come on. Come on. I do have um, my task forces, one of the Navy task forces set up to uh, help with the naval invasions. I am actually running out of oil. <laughs> Maybe not for long, but... Uh, there it is. And with that, we can declare war on a Paraguay. I had a, a naval battle against um, Argentina. I had them set up to uh, to do that. I am going to destroy this entire country. I am so not happy with them. They had like two or three hundred, you know, two or three times as long as I expected. Yeah, about twice as long as I would expect for anyone to uh, be justifying against. So we're, we're going to wipe them off the face of the planet. 
and I'm gonna enjoy watching that happen. All right. All in. Um, where are you? Yeah. Okay, they are going aggressive. Attention. Good. 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 I guess I haven't actually um, checked to make sure that my generals can't be upgraded. And if they can, might as well. It might help, like, the score or something. At the end, um, I don't think any of you are going to be. You have not uh, done anything. get anything, but, okay. Two over here. And, uh, sure. We're gonna have air speed already, but sure, you can do that. Okay. Okay. Let's check out the naval stuff. Brazil's going to have a lot stronger navy than I've faced in the last few wars. Apparently this is needing help as well. They will get it. They will get it. No, guys, we're not going to have anyone join this war. No, no. No need. No need. It was a uh, slight battle. But yeah, so anyway, the naval battle against Argentina, the, the guys were supporting the naval invasion, and uh, I didn't even see that there was a battle. And it was done. And I destroyed like 22 destroyers. And it was hilarious. At least to me. This is actually uh, going strong here. There's no one to guard this beach. So, that's fun. Uh, let's go here. That's enough there. And are you aggressive? You are aggressive. Good. I think that will help. That'll draw some troops away. Ah, there's their main fleet. Always oh, good to see. Just tell me someone is walking into their capital. Thank you. I need to set up a little bit more troops here. The Paraguayan border. Attention. This is what I want. They're stopping the actual Marines. Paraguay has capitulated. Solid. Take everything. Alright, so that is exactly where I want things to be. You're gonna go there, and you... You're gonna travel north. Stay in the forests. Got it, thank you. Don't really care. 
Alright. Brazil is it. 27% of the way toward capitulation. I have her superiority over here yet. I do not. I think we begin to uh, move our air. Time to make things happen. Cause I don't want to lose my moves right now, but if I can help it. Like to keep them. There we go. Yes, sir. That will give us upward. Naval invasion successful. Not as successful as this one, but still Ready successful. I have an airport here. Good. Let's go down here. We will grab some tactical. Grab some jets. And grab some strategic. And you know what? I'm going to grab some more tactical. Because they exist. Grab jet fighters? Oh, I must not have grabbed a jet fighters, okay. Thought I had. Um, no, we'll do 400. There's that. <laughs> 400 of 500. Well, fine. You can have 500. Not going to be the end of the world. So large battles happening up here. And we are of course winning. These guys are still losing over here in Rio de Janeiro. How many times do I have to teach you this lesson? We will destroy you. There we go. There we finally go. Okay, so we're going to have all 26 divisions on here, and then just kind of branch out, I think, to start. I think that will, will work to begin. Okay, um, basically I'm just, at this point, novelty and just getting every single thing I can. And we have everything except for the army side of things. And I may continue playing this game just to complete that just to say I did. We'll see. Uh, that would be obviously on my own turn. But, there we go. No more unassigned divisions. Stop with the unassigned divisions. Stop with the expeditionary forces. Uh, where are we, Eli? They have 49 to 69, and we have uh, 734. I number them. Uh, uh, quick math is 10 to 1. Might be 100 to 1. Don't know. We have uh, 8.5 million. They have 800,000. 
So yeah, 10 to 1. Took an extra second there. A little bit longer than it should have. Now Sao Paulo will be gone. These guys are pushing up very well. Come on. But yeah, I do recommend this uh, run to anyone who is looking for a fun Hearts of Iron 4 vanilla game. Uh, it's an excellent, excellent start there. This is really important stuff. Most of all of Brazil should be in the east if it's historical. Come on. There we go, we take this out. Pow! And that was it. Nicely done. Um, we'll take all states. Why not? And the war is over. And the achievement is complete. One empire is done. Um, let's see. There it is, one empire. Completed. So, whew. I want to thank anyone who has made it here uh, to this point for sticking with me through this whole campaign. And uh, if you have, please do like, please do comment, please do subscribe, you know, like, comment, uh, back on some other videos to let me know that you enjoyed this. But, uh, We'll be back um, probably next week. Uh, I think I'm going to want to play one of the Chinese areas, either Wanja Cleek or China itself, uh, and give that area a try. But um, I have been talking about gaming. I hope you've enjoyed this um, series, and I will see you whenever I see you.